Have you ever made a decision because it just felt right? Maybe you trusted someone or didn't trust them and you could never put your finger on why. That was probably intuition. Yes, it's a real thing. It's your ability to use learned, unconscious information to make better decisions or actions. We've developed a new way to measure and show that intuition is a real thing in the lab. It's a way to tap in and show how people can use unconscious information to make better decisions, faster decisions, and be more confident about those decisions. We verified this work through a range of different experiments using behavioral data, physiological data, and mathematical models. In the 10 years since I started working on intuition, I've developed a model that explains what intuition is and how to use it. From this model, I've developed five simple and easy to follow rules that can help our everyday decision making. First rule is about emotion and that you should never use your intuition if you're emotional. That includes positive emotion or negative emotion. The second rule is to only use your intuition for things you have experience of. For example, if you've never played tennis before, you don't want to use your intuition for the first time you play tennis. Fall back to the logical instructions from the tennis coach. The third rule is don't use your intuition for primal brain urges, for motivational things that can be addictive, like social media, gambling, drugs, alcohol. These things can create an urge, a drive that you want more, and it can feel a lot like intuition, but it's not intuition. Fourth, don't use your intuition for anything surrounding probabilities. We're really bad at understanding probabilities, and we should not use our intuition to try and think probabilistically. It just won't work. And the fifth rule is about the environment and context. Only use your intuition in familiar contexts. The way intuition works is it's based on learning, and learning is context specific. So if you've developed intuition, let's say in the office, and you try and use that intuition at home, it's not gonna work. So only use your intuition in familiar contexts. These five rules are based on science from my own lab, but also from hundreds of other labs around the world. Once we start to understand what intuition is and what it's not, it becomes clear when we can safely use it and when we can't. So I invite you to practice these five rules in your own decision making.